Alright, sorry about that. My Steam notifications were suddenly all back to the default settings, and you, that was the noise you kept Shit. hearing. Which way now? But I have turned that off. Okay. So, there wasn't really anything of value in here. So we just actually had to leave through that one door that was all prettied up. Question everything. I already do. Don't worry, old hippies that are no longer here. Well, that was quick. I think that was you. Don't look up, or even use your ears. on the inside. Always. I can't bring up my scanner. Maybe I can find it around here. You know, as much as I want to listen to Tony ramble on about America and conspiracies and things like that, I do want to get the hell out of here. Ooh, ooh, trouble. Trouble, 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 trouble. I'm trying to keep an eye out. What do we got here? You never know. There could be some secret words. Hidden on the walls. Protect our liberty! Never liked that Marcus kid anyway. Little fucking know it all. Can't believe you guys used to let scumbags like that live around. Illuminati. Shit. <sighs> we had them, Mexicans, hippies, some fucking dude, I don't know what he was. Once Tony took over, he changed the whole scene pronto. Hey, get this. The Mexican, he was a cop. Oh man, way too many cops around here lately. Yeah. Don't move. Tony says he loves that. So who's the guy paying the cops bounty? Tony doesn't know. Found his number on the uh, the ATF agent's phone. A quarter million bucks for a Mexican. Shit, man. I didn't know they got so expensive. Someone should go check on those assholes. See if they're thirsty. Then, not give them anything to drink. Put your hands Freeze. up. Freeze! Don't move. <clears throat> Alright. This is not how I wanted the situation to go. He heard me walking when I stood up for like a second. Things will be fine because now I've got the drop on him. What? 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 I was putting a shotgun at you. Oh my lord! I was putting a shotgun at them. At what point did they think in their minds, "Yeah, this is a good idea"? I mean, obviously it worked out for them, but fuck. Never liked that Marcus kid anyway. Little fucking know it all. Can't believe you guys used to let scumbags like that live around here. Shit, we had them, Mexicans, hippies, some fucking dude, I don't know what he was. Once Tony Please. took over, he Do changed not make the a whole move. scene. <sighs> the Mexican, he was a cop. Okay. With cops around here lately. Yeah, well, he's not a cop anymore. Tony says he fucked out of prison a couple days ago. So who's the guy paying the cops' bounty? Tony doesn't know. Found his number on the, uh, the ATF agent's phone. A quarter million bucks for a mix. Hold it! Shit. Don't you I move! Know they got so I expensive. <coughs> 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 See if they're thirsty. Then, not give them anything to drink. You guys are such dicks. This time around, hopefully I'll be a little bit more I successful. I had to say working. Free. Oh, come on! Well, was one of them the new- okay. I fucking told him to freeze, and he was like, Whoa! Uh, I like the freeze system, I like the whole stealthing thing, but I think there is a little bit of a fucking really annoying spree. Where sometimes they don't freeze, because for like a split second, 
You weren't in the most optimal position for doing. Hey, one of these idiots do had my scanner. Oh, is there evidence down here? No? Good. Although, with that said, it does say six evidence in the trailer park. Although, that could just be talking about the entire place in general. Hey, there's a ladder. That's our way out. Yeah. Come on. I want to be nice to the people. I don't want to fucking kill them, but if they're going to fucking, like, somehow spot me while their head is, like, pointing away from me, yeah, fuck that. Uh. Knock, knock! Oh, here we go. All right. We need to get our gear back. What? Are you nuts? Let's just get out of here! Look, if Stoddard gets his hands on it, he'll trace it right back to Kai and Tyson. Okay, we can't risk that. Shit. All right, so how you want to take this, man? There's a lot of Alpert's dudes down there. Uh, looks like there's a place to climb in on the left. Okay, but wait, or we could crawl under that fence over there on the right. Yeah, or we could take them head on. What? If you're up for that. And you lead. I'll be right behind you. That's what I thought. <laughs> Let's just go. Come on. You All right. Like that. Kill. I'm here. Not spoke. Nick, hit trailer. What trailer? That one way over there? Alright, we can head over there, but first I want to actually tag everybody. Get this entire system prepared. Hey, there's a the guy I need. Bloop. Jim Preston. I wish it would, like, pop up a little video on why they have a warrant out for them. And maybe it'd be an amusing video showing, you know, the altercation they had with an officer. Or a civilian, and then you could see that maybe their warrants are actually just really minor things, like he was being really annoying in a bank Look, or something. Shit, don't you have any other friends? Not out here. I need to find. I need to find my gear. I need to find something that'll allow me to, you know, take people out in a pretty nice way. Ooh, what is this? Oh my god, they were building a missile! What? The boomer connection. Let's look at this. Yeah, these guys want to blow up something. These aren't the hippies I knew. This blueprint for explosive is unsettling. Alpert's crew has military training and Alpert alone is as dangerous as they come. A bomb like this could do catastrophic damage if deployed in the wrong place. So, we should stop them, yes? I mean, that would be my general opinion of things. You gonna eat that thing? Mm, nah, just gonna skin it. Is that kind of a way? What am I, fucking Choctaw? Circle of life. Alright. I wanna figure out what I wanna do with these guys. Obviously, the better scenario... ...would be to actually... Arrest everybody. Yeah, I, I just changed them. <laughs> well, someone must have swapped them out. However, they are all in positions that might be disadvantageous for me. Although, the fucking alarm thing is over here. These ain't mine. Oh, God. Seriously? Hands up. Stay right where you are. You got it. He just splashed blood on my face, that little shit. Alright, we're gonna hope no one comes back here. Oh, fuck. I'm with the blood. I'm one with the blood. Hands up. Freeze! Keep on. You, even a <clears throat> you know the answer to that. You got people doing rumors and shit about what I used to be. Maybe you should pay attention to the gossip once in a while. Uh-oh. Is this where they're making the hotshot? Hotshot's been showing up around the country for the last couple of years. Turns out Albert's been cooking the liquid cocaine at his compound and using the revenue to finance a sizable military arsenal. A revolution funded by drug money. <laughs> Those don't typically work out very well. Ah. I hope it's been at the cooking hotshot this whole time. Ah, that explains a lot, actually. This explains how they can afford all the equipment and weaponry. The good news is that hotshot can be cut off at the source now. Yeah. 
it all comes down to this. We just have to kill everybody. Generally. Alright, let's disable this alarm, just in case someone decides to run at it or something. Oh yeah, I got a silver battle plaque! Ooh! I got my taser back. Good. So worse comes to worse. I can tase the dude. Alright, I'm just making sure he moves away from the area that other people are gonna end up going by. Hey! Keep those hands where I can see them. You got it! <sighs> Okay. Rest of the dude. Now I just have to go for others. How many other people are here? Is the real question I have. Alright. We're gonna have to assume that no one's gonna come over here. Although we're gonna keep an eye on the guy up top. You see how there's one slowly walking, that guy probably over there? Yeah, I want to make sure he's not going to, like, walk to the right as I'm freezing this dude. The hell? Hold it right and there. freeze! Aye, brother. I like how I pull out my fucking gun. Like, obviously, you know, that's to, to really reinforce things, but my taser would have been just fine. No one wants to be fucking tased. It's gonna knock them out immediately. There it is. Alright, let's swap out my gear. We need to be silent and deadly. Knock out. Uh, we already have my suppressor on there. Actually, no, we went with the AWM. Okay. Now take a nice long look All right. at the ghost Time to get out of here. Flash hire. Fully collapsible stock and a modified grip for maximum shooter comfort while spitting roughly 1,001 rounds per minute. It's your God given constitutional right to possess that thing, too. God given constitutional? Ain't that the same word? Damn straight. <laughs> Yeah, I'd like to see them, uh, ATF bastards try to take that piece of American ingenuity away from you. Yeah, that's right. Oh, wait, no, man, this, uh, this gun was made in Europe. Belgium, I think. You got a fucking Belgian gun? Well, yeah, it's a special order. This is hand princess. Feels wrong. They make a nice piece of hardware. Hey, boys! Hang on. Come on, puke away from my gun. Hold it! <laughs> puke away from my gun! <laughs> I probably should have arrested those two that are standing right next to each other while they were standing next to each other, because it would be bad if they disperse, and I'm like, oh, God. Hey, hey, guys, I'm going to arrest you for being nationalistic pricks. Hands up. Well, not him. He knows what's up. Oh, shit. I got the guy with the warrant, right? Yeah! That's what matters! Okay! God fucking damn it! What the fuck happened? What the fuck happened? Why did that happen? The, the two other people- the fuck- okay, I arrested two people who were right fucking next to each other. Am I gonna have to do it all over again? Because I am not gonna fucking do that. Thank God! At the Ghost One Flash Hider. Fully Look at this! Okay! Why? What the fuck? What the fuck? Okay, I have no idea what to say to this. Let me explain. Let me explain what's wrong with the scenario. Here are two people. Here are two random guys chilling out in the middle of nowhere. If you look at the map. The only people who could possibly see what's going on would be that guy. And that guy. Maybe. But, as soon as I told these guys to freeze, everybody went on immediate alert. And that makes me really mad, because in every other scenario in this game, that doesn't happen, because the fucking people are like super far away. That just makes me really fucking annoyed. Hang on. I think I'm 
<sighs> but fine, fuck it. I'll arrest everybody else but the guy I want. Then arrest them. God, they're like in prime position. Oh, I never put a good side on this. Whoops. Let me just do that. Okay, can I even put a sign on it? Of course I can, what the fuck am I talking about? I have no idea why I would need this. I want to see what this is look like. Alright. Time to get oh, that's not too bad. But I would prefer the sights to be a little bit closer. What about this? What does this site look like? Eh. I had to do some comparisons. Much better. I actually do like this ACOG site. Pew! Is that guy ever gonna fucking come back? That guy right there? Because I might just shoot him at this point. Oh shit, there's another guy. There are way too many people in this place. Alright, fuck it. Let's look for some evidence. Is it this? No. <laughs> the refrigerator is not evidence. But this information on Boomer is. Huh. Albert's got a government file on you. What? What's it say? It's very thorough. <laughs> Barnes was carrying out a dossier on Boomer. He wasn't out here to investigate Albert. He was checking up on Boomer's past. What reason would the ATF have for going after Boomer? Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. He's obviously black. He's 5'8". He was in the U.S. Army. He went AWOL in 2007. <laughs> wow, that's a long while. Warrant for failure to appear. Father deceased, mother status unknown. Um... Check with Tony Albert, survivalist shithead, multiple warrants, dangerous man. Albert, uh, apparently Boone was involved with Albert's daughter. What's connection to Mendoza? Okay. I like how he calls Tony a fucking dangerous person. That's just incredibly amusing to me. Alright. He's coming back. When he comes back, I'm gonna throw a handy little shell. Come on, buddy. You're an inquisitive mind. Curiosity. Stop. Arrest the cat. Because oh, all cats deserve to be in jail. Ooh, Ugh. I pressed E on him. <laughs> there are things in this game that require you to press E, and there are things in this game that require you to press F, and sometimes it just... the two don't link up. Hmm. Again, I can't arrest these two guys without arresting the guy in front of them. Because apparently, as soon as I told these two guys to freeze, he's all like, Yo, yo, I can see what's going on, even when he's turned around. So you know what? Let's go over to the left. Try to get him. Alright, I think we're a good enough distance away to not be heard. Two people are checking out the noise. 